Jack Disnett and his band have been here twice before, once I think in 1973 or 74 and once in 1976. We're very, very pleased to have Jack and the guys back again. Jack Disnett on percussion. Peter Warren on bass. John Purcell, saxophone. And Chico Freeman, saxophone. Jack Disnett, special edition. Position that I wrote entitled Tin Can Alley. <laughs> Thank you. 
very beautiful version of John Coltrane's Central Park West, played by Jack DeJanet's Special Edition. On tenor saxophone, Chico Freeman. On alto saxophone, John Purcell. Peter Warren on bass, and of course, Jack DeJanet on drums. My name is Gavin Walker, and you're listening to Jazzland. I had a chance to talk with Mr. DeJanet. Here's a few moments of conversation. How are you doing? Oh, pretty good. I have a, I have a ball, actually. <laughs> yeah. Do you like Edmonton? What's oh, happening? Well, it's been great. Been playing music almost 24 hours a day since I've been there. Peter and I really was knocked out with it. Yeah, Peter Warren, uh, your bass player, and uh, most of us are familiar with, with Chico Freeman. John Purcell is, is the newest member. Yeah, this, Where did he come uh, from? He's going to be uh, a giant, I tell you. He's going to be budding really soon. He was a big surprise. He was a nice find, as a matter of fact. In fact, Chico recommended him. Is that right? Sure. They had been, you know, playing together, you know, just jamming together the two horns. You know. Of course, I, I had just gotten out from the tour, so I didn't even hear him. Like, I, I asked uh, Peter and uh, Chico to audition him for me. <laughs> and so, they, you know, I just said, well, I trust your judgment, man. You know, turn him out and see what's happening. And, uh, Comparisons are generally a drag, but, of course, you, the record is out the special edition album. I just heard it last week with David Murray and Arthur Blythe. Uh -huh. Do you feel that this band is closer to what you want, this this present band? Yeah, I think it definitely has the potential to be... Because that last one was gigantic. Yeah, well, <laughs> we've got some compositions. Uh, if you heard the concert, there, there were new compositions there that will be recorded, like the first piece we opened up with, Tin Can Alley. It's going to be one of the tunes that will be recorded. Mm -hmm. On ECM? Uh, yeah. Peter has a couple of compositions that we haven't uh, rehearsed yet, but is in the works. So the book is going to expand. We also plan to uh, do standard, standard tunes. Also, we're going to work on some bebop tunes. So we're going to have a big spectrum. Just to, that way you really get to a lot of the cross-section of people and thereby actually really uh, redefining what Jack uh, and Special Editions music is about is multi-directional music, which is what I've been preaching the last year or so mm -hmm. to uh, get rid of this term uh, avant-garde. It doesn't appertain to the art ensemble or uh, Cecil Tenor or anything. I mean, it's like all that music has a form. We're, we are uh, playing from all the kinds of rules we all studied. I studied classical piano. Yes. Have discipline. We all had discipline. So we're not just out there doing uh, whatever comes to our head. We have a concept of uh, uh, preparation. We take, we have great care about what we're doing. We'd like to thank Jack DeJanet for sharing his very musical thoughts with us. We're going to return to the Shocker Theater, and as you can hear by the enthusiastic crowd, this man got a standing ovation. And... Uh, this is their encore.
John Purcell, Chico Freeman, Peter Warren, and Jack DeJunette. Special edition. Thank you, Jack DeJunette. Your dynamism, your energy. It's really hard to believe that that band only has four people in it. Jack DeJunette, special edition from the Shocker Theater, Jazz City, Edmonton, Alberta. Thank you. 
Thank you.